In recent decades, China has been undertaking the most ambitious infrastructure projects on the planet. In Africa, China has been assisting the continent in addressing its infrastructure deficit problems by financing and building some mega-projects that have left Western countries such as America jealous. Therefore, Africa, with its diverse nations and varying stages of development, is on the brink of transformation. Some countries are racing ahead, while others are catching up through Chinese-funded mega-infrastructure projects. We're talking about projects that aren't just reshaping landscapes but entire nations, and they're sparking economic revolutions, connecting people like never before, and even altering the political landscape. We're looking at improved trade, energy access, job opportunities, and above all, improved standards of living for millions. So, stick around, because in this video, we're going to unravel the economic, social, and political significance of these game-changing projects. We'll be exploring the potential, the hurdles, and the sheer ambition behind them. And let's dive right in. 9. Maputo Katembe Bridge, Mozambique. This is a suspension bridge that is 3.6 kilometers long and stretches majestically across Maputo Bay, connecting the bustling capital, Maputo, to the serene district of Katembe. Notably, this bridge holds the record for being the longest suspension bridge in the whole of Africa, as it has a main span of 680 meters and its twin towers on the north and south are each 141.2 meters high. Additionally, the Maputo Katembe Bridge is a magnificent masterpiece, was built at a cost of around $725 million with a loan from China, and was constructed by the China Road and Bridge Corporation. Moreover, this bridge is the missing link that connects the bustling city of Maputo to the untapped riches of Katembe. As a result, traffic has doubled, and cargo capacity has skyrocketed by a jaw-dropping 40%. Besides, during its construction, this megabridge provided jobs to over 4,000 local workers. 8. Mombasa Nairobi Standard Gauge Railway, SGR, Kenya. This is a state-of-the-art railway that stretches for a whopping 480 kilometers, connecting Kenya's bustling coastal city of Mombasa to its vibrant capital, Nairobi. Notably, it's a standard gauge railway with speeds that can hit a cool 120 kilometers per hour. You see, before this modern marvel, the journey from Mombasa to Nairobi could be a grueling 10-hour drive, but now it's just about 4.5 hours. Besides, the old railway line used to transport about 13 million tons of cargo a year. In fact, since its launch, the SGR has transported more than 3.2 million passengers and over 6 million tons of cargo. Furthermore, the SGR cost approximately $3.8 billion to build. Notably, around 90% of that funding was provided by China Exim Bank. Overall, the Mombasa Nairobi SGR is a lifeline of opportunity that is connecting people and spurring economic growth. 7. Kuruma Hydroelectric Power Station, Uganda. This behemoth is located on the mighty Nile River about 15 kilometers downstream from the incredible Murchison Falls. Notably, Africa, like the rest of the world, needs clean, reliable, and affordable energy. And that's where the Karuma power station steps in. This powerhouse has an installed capacity of a whopping 600 megawatts. Moreover, this megaproject came with a price tag of around $1.7 billion, and guess who's footed most of the bill? You got it. China. Notably, Kuruma is already paying dividends, as it's estimated to save Uganda over $200 million annually in energy imports. 6. Bagamoyo Port, Tanzania. This is a colossal deepwater port project nestled along Tanzania's picturesque coastline, near the historic town of Bagamoyo. Notably, Africa, with its abundant resources, is poised for economic growth, but to make it happen, it needs a modern, efficient, and bustling gateway, and that's where Bagamoyo comes into play. Furthermore, the Bagamoyo port is set to become one of the largest ports in Africa. It will cover an area roughly the size of 800 hectares. During construction alone, Bagamoyo is expected to create employment for tens of thousands of Tanzanians. Moreover, the estimated price tag is an eye-popping $10 billion in funding from China. 
and it's worth it since Bagamoyo is projected to handle up to 20 million containers annually. Overall, Bagamoyo is expected to supercharge Tanzania's exports, provide better access to international markets, and fuel economic growth across the region. 5. Kanitra Tangier High Speed Rail, Morocco This sleek, lightning-fast railway stretches for approximately 186 miles, or 300 kilometers, connecting Kanitra to the bustling port city of Tangier. The high-speed trains can cruise at a mind-blowing 186 miles per hour, or 300 kilometers per hour. Morocco, perched on the northwest corner of Africa, is a gateway to the continent, and thus it needs a train like the Kanitra Tangier high-speed rail to fully unlock its potential. Furthermore, the high-speed rail project cost an estimated $2 billion, with a significant chunk of the funding coming from China Exim Bank and Morocco's resources. 4. Lusakandola Dual Carriageway, Zambia This road is a modern marvel that stretches for a jaw-dropping 321 kilometers, about 200 miles, connecting Zambia's capital, Lusaka, to the thriving city of Ndola. Notably, before the dual carriageway, the journey between Lusaka and Ndola could be a bumpy, time-consuming affair, but now, it's like hitting the fast lane to progress. Besides facilitating convenience, the road is turbocharging Zambia's economy by connecting cities, spurring trade, and creating jobs. Furthermore, this megaproject cost an estimated $1.2 billion, with China being a significant partner, contributing both funding and expertise to make this ambitious road a reality. And it's worth it since the dual carriageway has reduced travel time between Lusaka and Ndola from 6 to 8 hours to just 3 to 4 hours. 3. Borg El Arab International Airport Expansion, Egypt This airport is not just about runways and terminals, it's a symbol of ambition and progress. Before the expansion, Borg El Arab was already serving Egypt, but now it's set to become an even more crucial transportation hub. Notably, Egypt's strategic location makes it a pivotal point for global travel and trade. Before the expansion, Borg El Arab handled around 3 million passengers annually. But now, with the new terminals expanded to 34,000 square meters and facilities, it's projected to handle over 30 million passengers every year. Therefore, this expansion isn't just about accommodating more passengers, it's about supercharging Egypt's aviation capabilities. Furthermore, it's estimated to cost around $20 billion, with a significant portion of the funding coming from China, which is playing a key role in making this aviation dream a reality. 2. Addis Ababa Djibouti Railway, Ethiopia and Djibouti Ethiopia, a landlocked country, needed a direct route to the sea for its imports and exports. And Djibouti, with its strategic coastal location, fits the bill perfectly. That's where this railway project steps in. Notably, before this railway, a journey from Addis Ababa to Djibouti could take days by road. Now, you can hop on a train and make the 759-kilometer trip in about 10 to 12 hours. Besides, this railway is not just providing convenience but also turbocharging economic growth by opening up Ethiopia to global trade, attracting investments, and creating jobs along the way. Furthermore, the estimated cost of this project was around $4 billion, with a significant part of the funding coming from China Exim Bank. Notably, since its completion in 2016, it has brought about massive returns since the railway has already transported millions of tons of cargo and thousands of passengers since its launch. 1. Nikala Corridor Railway, Mozambique, and Malawi This railway is a lifeline of connectivity between Mozambique and Malawi. Malawi, a landlocked country, needs a reliable route to the sea for its imports and exports. And Mozambique, with its coastal access, has come to the rescue. Notably, before this railway, transporting goods from Malawi to Mozambique's ports was a slow and expensive ordeal, but with the Nikala Corridor Railway, which will stretch to 913 kilometers, it will provide convenience and turbocharge economic growth by opening up Malawi to global trade, attracting investments, and creating jobs along the way. Furthermore, the estimated cost of this project is around $4.5 billion, with a significant portion of funding coming from China. 
Overall, before this railway, a journey from Malawi to the coast could take days by road, but following its completion, one can hop on a train and make the trip in a fraction of the time. Conclusion The Chinese-funded mega-infrastructure projects are setting Africa on a path to unprecedented growth and development. From railways that connect nations to ports that unlock trade potential and airports that open up new horizons, each of these projects paints a vivid picture of Africa's promising future. Well, from what we've seen, these projects are already making waves. They're reducing travel times, boosting trade, creating jobs, and attracting investments. While challenges and hurdles remain, the progress so far is undeniable. Thank you for joining us. Don't forget to hit that like button, share it, and subscribe to our channel. Until next time, take care.